everyone, I'm Mike. And I'm Elvis. And this is the Wheeler Dealers Workshop. The Wheeler Dealer Show brought a revolution in the world of car restoration shows. The makers of the show do not like the idea of having a conventional store, but roaming here and there to find dilapidated cars. It was a new angle, which the audience enjoyed a lot. The show is currently being hosted by the OG Mike Brewer and Mark Elvis Priestley. Mark Priestley was chosen to fill in the shoes of Ant Anstead and Ed China. Watch this video until the end to know Mark's journey and also to know if he is better than Ed China and Ant Anstead. The show has seen great mechanics like Ed China and Ant Anstead. It would have been hard for anyone else to fit into their shoes, but not for Mark Priestley, because he effortlessly won the audience's heart with his simplicity and knowledge. He joined the show in its 17th season, but his experience from being a mechanic on Formula One came in handy. Before joining the Wheeler Dealers, Mark had a growing chart in career. He started his career just after attending West Kent College, where he worked as an apprentice race mechanic for a series of matches. Soon he was also hired as a chief mechanic at Orbit Motorsport in Formula 3000. In 1999, Mark was hired by McLaren. He quickly rose through the ranks and even became the number one mechanic for the team's T-car. After working there till 2009, Mark left the team to pursue his career in media. He started writing in magazines and websites about motorsport. After his writings became popular, he got many invitations to join many news channels as a guest. Until 2021, he was part of many shows, but when Ant Anstead left the show, he was asked to replace him. And that's not it. He even stepped into the realm of voice acting in 2022. He voiced a race engineer in the F122 game. The man is insatiable. Now, coming to the actual question, is he better than Ed China or Ant Anstead? Ed China versus Mark Priestley. Both Ed China and Mark are great in their own thing. They both had their journey, but someone is better than the other. <laughs> Let's see who. Work experience. Ed China has the upper hand in this category, as he's older than him and has more experience, whether it be in general or the show. In the show, Ed has worked for 14 years and Mark Priestley has only hosted one series. We can see Ed China is the winner here. Fanbase. We feel like this category is the best factor to decide someone's success. We compare their Instagram and Twitter social medias, and here are the results. Ed China has 186,000 followers with 319 posts on Instagram and 154.2 thousand followers on Twitter. On the other hand, Mark Priestley has only 52.7 thousand on Instagram with 1,658 posts, and his Twitter followers are only 39.3 thousand. Again, Ed China is the clear winner here. By judging the two most important factors, that's experience and fan following, I think somehow Ed China is better than Mark Priestley. We'll use the same two criteria to judge Mark Priestley and Ant Anstead now. Ant Anstead versus Mark Priestley. Ant Anstead co-hosted the show from 2017 to 2021 after Ed left the show. Mark joined the show in 2021 and is an experienced F1 mechanic. They both are the best from where they come, but only one of them can be the winner. So let's find out who. Work experience? First, let's see who has more experience with the show, Wheeler Dealers. It's very obvious it's going to be Ant. He worked in the show for four years. But when we see Mark, he's more of a new joinee. But in general, the role is reversed. In automobiles, Mark has more experience. His work with F1 and media career. I think it's only fair that we let Mark win this round. Fanbase. We feel like this category is the best factor to decide someone's success. And we compare their Instagram and Twitter social media presence. And here are the results. Ant has 451 followers with 1,555 posts on Instagram and 77.9 thousand followers on Twitter. On the other hand, Mark Priestley has only 52.7 thousand on Instagram with 1,658 posts and his Twitter followers are only 39.3 thousand. Here, Ant is the clear winner. By judging the two most important factors, that's experience and fan following, it's a tie. Now, coming to the conclusion, I do not think that Mark is better than either of the two. What are your thoughts, though? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, do let us know by dropping a like and also hit that subscribe button if you never want to miss out on more such videos.